we are going to do a guided meditation into the golden healing temple uh, of Telos. And I wrote about this in Adama Discourses, if you want to do it again yourself. So once again, put yourself in that golden sphere of light, close your eyes, and get ready for a pretty awesome journey. I want you to use your intuitive skills that you just learned to follow what I'm about to describe. And know that it's your intention that guides you. So focus on your viewing screen, listen, and feel what's happening around you. Now envision your conscious awareness going diagonally into the earth toward Mount Shasta, which is pretty much directly behind you. And you can... Um, Oh, excuse me, I have to give you a few details. Um, you, before we do this, you are not limited in the same way that you are in your 3D body. You can do things like walk through rocks, fly through the air, breathe underwater. Um, you don't have to talk because it's mind-to-mind -mind communication there. You don't have to walk. You can fly or soar. And some people may just see really cool colors. Some people may just see white light. Some people may feel great love. Others may get really particular journeys that they go on. It doesn't really matter. Just flow with the flow and trust that what you're getting is perfect for you. Even if it's different than what I am describing here, know that your soul is giving you your own personal experience and go with that. Now, you're going diagonally into the earth toward Mount Shasta. As you get down into the earth a certain distance, you find yourself in a cavern that leads directly into the city of Telos, a large round cavern. At the end of the cavern, you'll see a bright light, and that is the entrance into the city of Telos. Someone is waiting there to guide you, so say hello to them and follow their lead. They already know where you want to go. Envision yourself moving forward next to your guide as he or she takes you to the Golden Healing Temple. They'll wait outside for you, out, outside of the temple, until your work is complete there. The temple looks like a large dome that's taller than it is wide. It's golden white in color and is glowing brightly. As you get closer, you begin to hear celestial music that uplifts and enchants those who enter. There are no doors or windows in the temple because the walls are porous and you simply float right through them. As you do so, you notice how thick they are. They seem to be about four or five feet wide, but they're vibrating in a way that makes it hard to see their exact width. Float slowly through the wall and surrender to its powerful healing qualities as it begins to restructure your etheric body, realign you with all that is and put you in the inner sanctum of your heart. Allow that realignment to work its way through you. Once you've gone through the wall, you notice that the floor of the temple is made of white light and is less porous than the walls are. So you can either walk on top of the floor or float above it in your light body. There's a huge wide open space inside of the temple and in the center, you see a pool of water. There are many other beings there too, taking in the healing powers of the Golden Temple. They're focused on their own experiences, just like you are. You find yourself drawn to that small pool and notice a golden, the golden flower petals that are floating on its surface. Their fragrant essence emanates throughout the entire temple. The water in the pool is used for ceremonial anointing, or as a potion to lift you to higher heights. The pool guardian offers you just enough water to fill your palm. You can either anoint yourself or drink it, whichever feels right to you. On the inside of the golden walls, there are holographic images of various saints and enlightened ones that hold the frequency and vibration of their dedication and service throughout their various lifetimes, which adds to the power of the temple. There are also many curved rays of energy that are slowly moving in a wave-like fashion through the entire temple, as if they're dancing to their own rhythmic pace. They are radiant waves of harmonic color and light, 
that imprint their healing frequency on those who pass through them. Notice how mesmerizing it feels to walk through the radiant waves as you drink in their wonderful healing qualities. High-level initiations occur in this temple along with sacred ceremonies, initiations, and more. Ask your intuitive self what you are to do next and follow through on its request. Stay there as long as you feel guided to do so. At some point, you'll begin to feel the energy around you shift or to dissipate which means your work at the temple is almost complete. Once you're complete, float back through the walls of the temple and notice how some of the essence from the walls comes along with you and remains in your energy field until it's been fully absorbed. Give thanks for what you've received in the temple The Telosians are always happy when their brothers and sisters visit them. They've been visiting you in your dreams and meditations for a very long time. They want you to know that intention is the key to your return visit. So no matter where your physical body might be, visit them often to rebuild relationships and learn more about each other. Personal experience is one of the best teachers and they're glad you came to visit them today. It's time to leave Telos now, so give thanks to your guide as he or she directs you out of the city and back into the cavern. As you float through that cavern, focus on returning to your physical body. Once you're back in your body and well-grounded, open your eyes when they're ready to open and notice the smile on your face. Enjoy the peacefulness you now feel as the radiance of the golden healing temple still shines within you. It may take some time for you to fully integrate what you received here, so let your intuition assist you in doing that. Feel free to keep yourself in that deep state of relaxation with your eyes open or closed. 